G'day Cody, uh, Ian here mate, in regards to the Falcon Champion. Uh, mate, I'll just start off here with the engine, um, so you can look at it, it's, uh, it's pretty clean. Um, work that's been done on it in the last couple of weeks. Uh, I uh, got a second hand battery and replaced it, I ac accidentally uh, shorted the old battery in it. Um, so uh, it's got a reconditioned battery. Uh, mate, all the uh, down under the, the uh, uh, power steering there was a, uh, a leak to uh, a hose so uh, my mechanic put a brand new hose on uh, so that's uh, solved that problem mate uh, it's had a brand new coil pack put in it uh, plus new plugs new leads these are brand new these leads and the plugs etc down in here uh, mate um, she everything else is fine like as far as radiator uh, belts uh, the aircon is ice cold and it? it's a bloody beautiful unit for the uh, air conditioning uh, mate yeah so over, overall um, and it's been well maintained mate and uh, it's got low K's considering it's uh, what 26 year old now um, or going on 26 mate that's the front of it here um, like I said it's got some uh, light protectors as you can see on both sides um, uh, it's, the uh, condition of the front etc is in pretty good nick for its age got a couple of little scrapes here um, as you can see mate but only very very minor uh, now getting to the getting to the tyres mate they've only been on the car for about 15,000 K and they're Bridgestone Taranza uh, Serenity Plus tyres they are uh, mate, so you're going to get at least another probably around 60,000 Ks out of those tyres, out of the set. The whole four were replaced at the same time. Um, mate, just moving on. Uh, bonnet's in very good condition uh, for its age again. Uh, no dents, no, no uh, scratches or anything there. Uh, brand new wiper blades put on mate and uh, what I'll do is I'll send you a copy of the blue slip and all the other paperwork just in photograph mate with this video so you can have a look at the work that was done uh, by Gary Hudson mate down here in Tamworth uh, mate it's got power like you operate your mirrors from inside so you got you can see the button in there um, so you got power mirrors uh, for uh, uh, controlling your left and right uh, mirror um, don't worry about that button that alarm one system I uh, it used to be in this car when it was first purchased by my brother-in-law um, who used to work for CGI, CGI insurance in Sydney and um, but it hasn't got in there now um, uh, so but it has got a, what they call a smart lock system for the car so the they're not a very easy car to break into and to take off mate just going internally here now um, as you can see had uh, seat covers on the front so I've taken them off to show you the condition of the seats uh, inside is really nice all the trims fine um, the only downside inside the car Cody is the roof lining mainly on the driver's side has started to let go as you can see right along this is on the driver's side okay but the other side hasn't begun to sag now i got a quote uh, you can see where it's just starting to sag over here um i got a quote and it'd be around about 300 dollars to replace this the, this type of liner okay mate um uh, but like i said down here we've got a this is a two-year-old uh, Kenwood sound system. Uh, it's got CD player as well as radio, as well as Bluetooth. So I know you young trendy blokes, you need your Bluetooth. So you've got that uh, there as well, mate. She's a stick automatic, as you can see there. It's also got a power button, as you can see here. That's an economy button. So when you got it down, she's in economy mode. When, when you need a bit more extra grunt going up hills or towing or whatever, uh, you've got that as well. Um, you've got uh, these buttons here for your uh, front windows, for up and down. 
in the back, mate, there's still the wind-up windows. But in front, you've got um, power windows. Uh, like I said, the aircon is super cool. Uh, functions beautifully, mate, actually. So uh, you'll be nice and cool if you're cruising around in this girl. Now, the other thing, you, other thing to remember, Kate, is that this car in four years' time... Uh, will become historic which means which means the value of this car will will likely over the next four years keep increasing in value so by the time it turns uh, historic in another four years it'll be probably worth two to three times as much as you uh, around that five thousand dollar figure of today so mate if you buy this car um, you need to really think about looking after it properly um, so that you keep it in a pretty good condition because you will make a lot of money off it, mate. You won't lose money on a car of this age going into uh, the historic years. But, uh, mate, continuing on, just jump out of here. Mate, at the back of the car, I oh, don't mind me cat. It likes sleeping over there in the car. But the seats, mate, are all in good nick. Very good nick. There's no dramas there. Um, like I said, internally, it's literally only the uh, roof, uh, the the roof line that's sagging, buddy. Uh, as you can see, the interior light and everything's working, etc. All in very good condition. Uh, mate, just at the back here, you've got two uh, Pioneer speakers. They're factory. Uh, and I'd leave it all factory. I'd leave this as original as you can because you'll get more money for it in the future. Uh, now you'll note down here, I've got a hub cap off. I need to uh, just fix up a couple of the uh, a couple of these here for you, mate. So it'll hang in the hang in the uh, the uh, wheel itself properly. Um, and I'll get that sorted, mate, uh, today or tomorrow and uh, have that repaired properly for you, mate. Um, you'll notice another little dent there, just here on the wheel arch. Can be, could be taken out quite easy with, with one of those uh, guys that run around doing the um, uh, paintless dent uh, f fixing up, mate. Moving to the boot, she's a bloody large boot, all nice and clean. Um, and under here obviously there'll be the spare wheel and as you can see from there that's actually factory that was a factory Dunlop mate it's r rarely been used um, it comes with a jack of course and everything like that mate sorry I had my bloody hand over that buddy I'll do that again uh, yeah so there you go mate that's the spare comes with a jack and all that type of stuff but yeah it's, it's rarely been out of its case uh, also a tow bar mate for you now with this the age of this car you'll notice that it's got a it's only got a, um, a round socket but um, you, you can easily pick up uh, the adapters that go for probably around I don't know 30 35 bucks or something at uh, Repco or anywhere uh, but underneath it's all pretty clean it's all it's always been highway highway road use mate um, there's no rust. There's one little uh, up the front little mud flap. I've just got to uh, tighten it all up because it's just banging a little bit. So I'll have that all tightened up. Um, but like I said, she's uh, she's in pretty good nick, mate, for its age. Um, now you'll just notice. Just think like I've got to find it. It's not. Yeah, just there. Um, there's a tiny little ripple mark here as well that could be easily repaired um uh, that's about all there and there's puss still having to sleep a little bugger but all the door rubbers mate are in really good condition as well so you won't have to worry about replacement of anything like of that um yeah so that's passenger side now, like I said before, mate, have I got them? No, I've already taken them out. I'll, I'll, um, I'll uh, send you separate photos of all the paperwork, all the owner manuals, all that type of thing, mate, which I've got inside. Um, 
but yeah she's a she's a pretty classy girl and I tell you what she goes well goes really well um, I still know because <clears throat> I've been in sales management for 35 years mate and I still know sales reps that drive these around on the highway with 600,000 Ks on them now that's the worst that some woman backed into the into the guard um, down here at Coles and that was only uh, a few weeks ago actually now I've tried to get it out the best I could because she actually caved it right in um, but yeah uh, again it's a relatively easy fix um, not really a major drama mate but yeah you can see there the condition of those tyres uh, like I said they've only got literally 15,000 k's on them mate and then just a couple of more little scuff scratches uh, mainly in car parks I'd imagine my sister did this actually not me yeah so that's about overall mate what the what she looks like she's a really good beast very honest car mate <clears throat> and um, any works that I've had anything that has gone wrong has been fixed immediately by um, like qualified mechanics mate and um, as you can see I've got a couple of other cars there's me that's a 29 year old 318 uh, BMW which turns 30 next year so that's getting me pretty excited and this is me pride and joy over here this is me uh, 320 uh, Mercedes and as you can see I do look after me vehicles mate um, so I'm uh, it's pretty much me, me hobby uh, keeping cars in good condition mate so anyway have a look got any more questions buddy just give me a hoi cheers